So here we are at the third and final stage of this figure. should look really powerful after this stage. Start with the costume again. A bit more carefully notice now. But still very loose because I've got all my information basically. So all I'm doing now is highlighting and developing the drawing. The light on there. Possibly a little bit in there like that. Definitely some across there. And the face, we've got some above the eye. Very large amount of light on the nose. Certainly some light under the lip there and on the chin. Up towards the jaw. Under the eye there. In the ear, of course. And on the neck. Nice and loose look. See, it's all just basic, very, very sharp drawing. So, in the hair, a little bit of light in that. Nice piece coming down, exaggerate that a little just to give you a bit of a lovely feeling of flowing across the head, a bit to the side like that, across the top, let it be nice and loose. Keep the dust off all the time. And into the breast there. Down, right down to the hip, right down, and right down and across the tummy, into there. Very quite a nice light in there, in the belly button itself down and up from that as well. In the hip here, a bit of light, a lot on the tummy here. And on the hip. In there, and right like that. Get on the edge there, yeah. get through that horrible line as well. Costume itself, the light on there, a bit of light across there, that just to give it its feeling of the form. Inside leg, outside leg there, and the leg can come quite loosely. Another leg. And the back of there, down the arm. background just a little. Might have a little bit of negative space as well just to make the figure really stand out but most of it is really light in the background under my studio. Okay now the compressed charcoal for the beautiful part of the drawing up. So again I look at the eyes strong in there. A bit of an eyelid there and an eyebrow it needs to be quite strong. Eye there, quite strong too. Inside here, good and strong in there, a little bit, and there, and down behind the ear. So the hair is very strong and dark in that bit there. A bit of a rub. There's a little bit of a shoulder showing there. In there is quite strong, and under there, up there a little bit, and the same there, into there a little bit, under there is quite strong, and down there. Quite dark and strong in here, the hip there like that. Now when we do the tummy this time, we should use our fingers a little. Give it a tap and a bit of that in there. Nicely done. Quite dark under the arms, up a bit and down there like that. A shadow crack. Bit more body to this arm here, I think. Give a little bit there, just a little bit split up a little, and the brush to give it some shadow. Should develop the fingers more, but doesn't need too much, I don't think. This is just a demonstration drawing. 
nice and strong under there and it's quite strong into the leg here and, that, and into the bottom there very strong too put a bit of shadow in there maybe a bit in there too definitely a bit in there Okay, we're getting fairly close now. Could be a bit of shadow under there, but under there. Bit of negative space, where should I put a bit of negative space? Don't need too much. Perhaps a little down the leg in here. Just to give that body a bit of a stand out in there. Let's go out there as well. Don't do it too tightly. Definitely a little bit under there and possibly down there and down the legs into there and so there she goes and there we've got not a bad looking figure a little closer Get a good look at it and thank you for your attention see you soon with another figure I'd imagine